Okay, back to the park. First signal, I got a little coin spill here. I got a nickel and a penny. Wow. So this is like my fourth signal or something. I got some trash, but look at that. Another buffalo nickel. That is so crazy. I can't even tell you. How many buffaloes have I pulled out of here? It's gotta be like my seventh one or something. So that's a 1936. Awesome. Wow. Maybe there's a mint mark, say. No, it doesn't look like it. So 1936 Philadelphia, I guess. Boom. All right, see what else we can get. All right. This is less than a foot away from the other buffalo. Also a nickel sound and deep. So let's try live digging this sucker, see if we can do it. Buffalo nickel live dig. I did get one V nickel out of this park though, so who knows? Maybe it'll be a V. Sorry, it's really hard trying to do a live dig and film. Got Tom. See what we got. Ooh, out of the hole. <laughs> Curse the live dig. Of course, it's not going to be a buff. Looks like I found Sonny's dog tag. Boom. Man, looks like I found the lid to a pipe. Boy, I had some hope for that one. That was coming up nice. Thought maybe it was going to be a silver dime. Whoa, now that's a big old piece of iron. I don't know. I kept digging it because I thought maybe it was going to be like a great big Tootsie car or something. I have a few that are about this big. So you just never know. Look at that. Bottom feeder. <laughs> All right, 1925 Weedy. You know why I'm not filming any cloud? Because I'm not digging it. It's just not here. It's crazy. It's like old stuff and pull tabs mostly. All right, see what else we can get. Okay, so I dug way down underneath this root. And I got me a 19, I think it's 1920 weedy. Just can't get the silver, man. All right, let's keep going. All right. Got ourselves a deep squeaker here. Let's try a live dig. Eventually, there's gotta be a piece of silver in here. I think this will at least be like a wheat penny. Okay. Okay, so it looks like it's a weedy. I think it says 1940. So, anyways, I always gotta check and make sure it's not one of the uh, there's several million dollar wheat pennies. So, I always wanna check those dates, guys. So 
You just never know. Lightning's gonna strike. All right, well, I got a gold ring out of here last night. Hopefully we can uh, do it again. Okay, I got another deep nickel. I think, let's see what we got. Nope, not that time either. Alright. Let's see how old this sucker is. I think it would still be, yeah, 64. Not that old. Well, I just got me a dime. You know, I just still, I mean, I actually have several episodes shot in this part. I don't think I've got a single piece of silver. So whoever cherry picked this did a good job. Uh, who knows, maybe I'll uh, run into one they didn't find. All right, I got some more weirdness. <laughs> so this is like metal. It's kind of notched right here, the little like metal point in there. And the top, if I can hang on to it, seems to have like a rubber suction cup. <laughs> I don't know what that is. You tell me. Oh, I thought, I thought, oh, maybe I get a silver ring here or something. I was ringing just above a zinc penny. Nope, oh, it's a fishing liner. Crazy. Man, I might have done it again. Nope, regular nickel this time. Oh, I had me going there for a second. Alright, got somebody's old truck key. Boom. Looks like 70s. Alright, I'm gonna have a good one here. Look at that. Nice sterling ring. That's really cool. I usually get somebody's name in it. Sterling silver, boom. So what I'm doing is all the swimmers, I'm just looking for surface signs. It's my first target. Okay, so there's a bunch of change I didn't show you. Look at that. Hmm. Huh. I don't see a mark. This is probably going to be bling. It's a nice piece of bling, though. Well, let's see what else we can get. Okay, well, <laughs> work has been rough lately. I haven't had much of a chance to get out. I'm able to go out for like an hour or something like that. And tonight, I just got run off by lightning. So. I don't know, I got about a half hour in, but I did get this ring and that other piece of bling. Bunch of coins. Man, it's disappointing, because I know I could have got something good. It's been a lot of people down here at the lake. But anyways, if you can see, that's kind of tribal. It's like a male bird on top of a female bird. Yeah, sterling silver. So, I guess I'm just gonna add this hunt to another hunt, because <laughs> I, I don't know how I can just do a two two target hunt. So, anyways, see you on the next one. All right. So Brad and I just we've been digging like crazy, and we got a bunch of collad. Really, nothing to show you other than that gold coin. Um, we thought this was gonna be a lot uh, older ground, but. Here's a weedy, first one, so maybe there is some hope. This was kind of like an old railroad yard, so we're finding a bunch of huge metal. So hopefully things will pick up, but if not, we might have to switch. Okay, well, 1942, weedy. Look at that cool old chimney. Boom. How neat is that? All right, Brad had to go, so I went to an old camp, and uh, look at that, my first relic. Looks like a teeny salt and pepper shaker. 
How cool is that? Okay, just get my first old button. Well, I got me another one of those little buttons. <laughs> 